You know, guys, this getting old shit is really getting old. Uh, it, it's, you know, like Humpty Dumpty Drive, getting old is not for pussies. It's not for fucking pussies. So, this is my morning. I was, uh, so, you know, I'm sleeping up in Blue Dragon way up that steep staircase through the woods. So I was up there getting ready. I got some people checking in in a couple of hours. So I was going through the whole house saying, what do I need to bring up to, you know, what do I need to drag up here? Uh, I want to do this in one trip so I'm not running back and forth. I actually wrote down, there were four items I needed to bring up there to Blue Dragon. I needed to bring some paper towels. I needed to bring some coffee. Obviously, I needed to bring some clean sheets. And I needed to bring the lampshade to the lamp. So I have them written down in front of me on a list. <clears throat> so with the list in my hand, <coughs> I check it off. I go find every four items, I lay out the paper towels, I lay out the coffee, I lay out the sheets, I lay out the lampshade down here. So then I got everything together. So I'm all set to head up to Blue Dragon. So I gather up the paper towels, I gather up the coffee. I gather up the sheets. Lampshade sitting right there, <clears throat> written down on a note. I get all the fucking way up to Blue Dragon. I put the sheets on the bed. I put the paper towels out. I fill up the coffee. And I feel like there's still something missing. And I'm looking around and I notice the lamp does not have a lampshade on it. Here I am, back down, getting ready to go back up that motherfucking hill to bring a lampshade. Uh, now, I would say that 40% of my life in the past couple of years is spent doing shit like this. It, it, you know, it doesn't even matter if you write a fucking list off. You, you write it all down on a list. You get to an age, and, and I'm not stoned. I, I mean, I'm jacked up on my morning coffee. I feel totally awake and alert. It, it is unfucking believable the amount of my fucking life that I spend uh, looking for shit and forgetting shit and doing things. I remember when, when I was headed off to the, to the Gray Fox Bluegrass Festival, it, it, you know, I had to get Sea Dragon, Sea Dragon, Seahorse ready for these people. You know, the one way up at the top of the fucking mountain. So I slept in Seahorse the night before now, I did not write it down, but I made a mental list of everything that uh, I needed out of Seahorse to take to that goddamn bluegrass festival I wish I'd never heard of. Went over and over and over in my head. The, 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 the tiny house is 8 feet by 10 feet. 8 feet by 10 feet. There's probably, if you added up every single object up in that fucking tiny house, there might be 20 separate objects in there. I needed to take four things out of that 8 by 10 foot tiny house to that bluegrass festival. How many trips did I make back up that fucking hill. Four items. How many trips, how many times did I walk from here all the fucking way up to that top of the hill? 
This is a real no-brainer, guys. Uh, if your answer was Hambone took four round trips up to that top of the up to the top of that fucking hill to retrieve the four items he needed out of an eight by ten tiny house, give yourself a gold star. Un fucking believable. Did you look at this flower box, guys? <laughs> you know, that truly is a, uh, a, a work of art. Uh, well, this is the most outrageous flower box I have ever. That is three impatiens and two coleuses. Is it coleuses or coli? So, I am getting ready to do my, after I take the fucking lampshade uh, up this hill, I need to do, finally do my uh, Manga Bay Roundup. And then I need to get in this fucking truck and drive back to that motherfucking bluegrass festival to rescue my friend who has probably been buried in a fucking landslide. Uh, I have to drive three fucking hours, find my way to her campsite, uh, from the highway, load up my fucking tent and all of that shit, slog through the fucking mud, and drive three hours back. So I can get up tomorrow morning and take her to the fucking Syracuse airport. Oh, God. So, uh, I see the storm clouds approaching. It is a gorgeous morning here in the end times. It is Saturday, July 15th. And it looks like uh, they're talking about a major ass-kicking headed our way tonight. What a fucking surprise. Another ass-kicking. I have all three of these tiny houses rented tonight in this fucking, uh, you know, severe thunderstorms, high winds, hail storms. <sighs> Life in the end times. I am up a hill to take a fucking lampshade to a tiny house. Bye, guys.